today certainly belong to the man that's number one on your running back board, Bucky, Ezekiel Elliott. Uh, certainly put on a show, and he is hanging out at our Wolves Den, the social set with Colleen <laughs> Wolf, what? Why are you laughing, Colleen? Because are he like these guys have no idea that we are like blowing up their spot right now with like all of their personal posts and uh, he comes over and he's uh, laughing. Which one were you just laughing at? All of them, oh. you said. All right, so Ezekiel Elliott joins us now. Listen, I'm sure you've had uh, a crazy couple of days. What's the oddest thing that's happened so far? Uh, I have to say the, the interviews. The interviews were pretty odd. You know, just kind of the mind games they play with you in the interview rooms. Or, just can get your mind boggled, you know, having 15 of those back-to-back -back days are just That's a lot. It's crazy. How long, how long, like how many hours did you interview for? Uh, well, I had 15 total interviews, and uh, they're each 15 minutes, but, you know, they're just tiring. You know, after a long day of medical, after a long day, and uh, at the end of your day, you know, not getting finished. So, you know, my latest meeting, I started at 1045, so, you know, that just gives you uh, wow. perspective. Do any of the questions, like, stick out to you? Were there, were there any questions that were, like, really kind of off the wall? Uh, I didn't have any too many, too crazy questions. Just, you know, going through all that, you know, you know, having a meeting at 1045 when you woke up at 4 a.m. is, is kind of crazy. That's early. All right, so <laughs> you obviously balled out in college. We know that. But what are you going to miss most about playing with all of your teammates? Teammates aside, what are you going to miss most about college in general? Uh, you know, I think just the atmosphere. The atmosphere at the Ohio State is crazy. You know, the best. Uh, fan base in, in college football. I think the best fan base in sports. Look at you, young buck. So you also <sighs> played basketball. You ran track. When when was this taken? Like last year? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I think I was about eight. You know, you see the, the MJ tongue. Coming I know. Out, look know. at that. I was a baller. <laughs> you already have swagger there. My God. All right. So um, also, when you look at, um, I, I was looking through all of your social feeds. Mm -hmm. And um, by the way, this one too. Come on. Like uh, <laughs> those pads are huge on you. I know. <laughs> Um, you uh, asked Taylor Swift out on a date. I was looking all over the place for updates on this, if anything ever happened. Did she ever get back to you? And, like, what were your plans? Where were you going to take her if she took you up on it? Uh, no, she never got back to me. But, you know, I was going to take her to Hyatt Park, the best steakhouse in Columbus, you know. Uh, all right, not bad, not bad. Um, also, we got some uh, pics of you and your boo here. What's, uh, what's it, boy, girl? This is a boy. Uh, what's his name? This is Ace. You know, he's my best friend. Uh, he's a nine-month, you know, old Roddy, and uh, he's a sweetheart, you know. I love this guy. Do you think you could beat him at the 40? No, he, he, he's a beast. <laughs> <laughs> what would his 40 time be? Probably 3-9. That's, that is pretty impressive. Beat Chris Johnson. And you got some uh, some tats here. So how many tattoo, tattoos do you have? Uh, you know, I got just a half sleeve of my chest done. But, you know, this is my first tattoo, so I got all this done at one time. And I remember uh, I didn't tell my mom. I just sent her a picture uh -oh. of it. And she told me she was going to come down to Columbus and uh, skin me. So, you know, she well, wasn't too happy. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure that would not have gone over too <laughs> well. Wow. All right, listen. Also, we have... Uh, this tweet here. So um, you were asked, uh, you know, why you would want the Dallas Cowboys to select you in the draft. So do, are you still feeling like you want to go to Dallas? Uh, you know, I think every running back here that, that competed, they will have to go play behind the offensive line. So it's it's a pretty <laughs> solid line. Not yep. to mention that stadium under the bright lights. Talk about bright mm -hmm. lights in a huge stadium. I mean, Jerry World, yep. not a bad place to play. All right, Ezekiel, thank you so much. Best of luck. This has been great. We'll talk to you soon.